welcome back students now today's session we are going to learn the preparations of alkynes right so we have uh, completed the alkenes in alkenes chapter now let's start with preparations so alkynes we've already discussed what are the different methods in the previous video now let us start with the first type of method uh, that is your industrial method of preparation of alkynes so basically you have industrial method or you have lab method like, like the electrolysis process let's go about with the preparation so when i have to speak about the industrial method of preparation so let's divide this you have two types as i said industrial method of preparation of alkynes as well as we also have a lab method that is <coughs> laboratory method and that we'll be studying about a synthesis called Bertillet synthesis Bertillet synthesis okay yes Bertillet synthesis this was uh, uh, given by Perry Bertillet a French chemist done so when I have to speak about the industrial method of preparation so here basically the old there are two ways in this in that we have the old method as well as a modern method so when we speak about the old method of industrial preparation first you know coke or carbon is taken to this what is added calcium oxide is added now what they're going to do they're going to heat this mixture at 200 degrees centigrade when they heat the mixture suppose i am what am i preparing i'm preparing alkynes so the basic alkyne is what acetylene isn't it right i am trying to prepare this from this so now carbon or coke if i have to prepare so let me take this is three carbons or three coke then what happens let's see here when you heat this at 200 degrees centigrade just carefully observed there are three carbons isn't it yes now this three carbon first important thing this carbon combines with this okay one carbon combines with this oxygen comes out as carbon monoxide now how many are left here two are left isn't it so two carbons are left and one calcium is left isn't it this is already broken so two carbons and two calciums so two carbons let us write as c2 left over is calcium this is called calcium carbide now this calcium carbide is further treated or it is hydrolyzed addition of water now just see here this is broken here done this is also broken here now this calcium comes out with calcium hydroxide right let's write that it comes out as calcium hydroxide now what is left out it is left what is left here water h2o isn't it right so h2 c2 h2 so c2 h2 no this is nothing but acetylene preparation simple isn't it so this is how it is prepared uh, the old method of preparation so there is one more method of preparation yeah in the uh, uh, as industrial method what they do they're going to take coal the same thing like coca coal then they're going to do hydrogenation means they're going to add hydrogen and heat it when they go and had hydrogen what happens is during this process this coal gets converted into hydrocarbons that is acetylene and whatever non-volatile uh, sol salts are there you know that will come out non-volatile salts non-volatile salts they deposit off where only acetylene is left we collect there is also one more method of preparation of uh, uh, acetylene that is from methane so methane that means this is when they ask you what is the conversion method of alkenes to alkynes you can use this process what do they do they want to take methane yes just see here methane formula is ch4 when they heat methane at 1500 degrees centigrade yes right so now suppose if i take uh, two moles of methane isn't it now how many hydrogens are there four twos are eight hydrogens how many carbons two isn't it let us write that c2 right among that among eight hydrogens six will come out as hydrogen gas this hydrogen gas six will come out so three two is six how many are left out among eight six are out we are left out with only two isn't it now c2h2 so this is the preparation of acetylene c2h2 is nothing but c ch triple bond ch is it so this is the this is the uh, industrial method of preparation of acetylene now let's come back and see the lab method of preparation of acetylene right so again here we have an old method as well as modern method so when i have to speak about the old method of preparation of acetylene first important thing just see here i'm going to take coke i'm going to heat it with carbon or coke i'm going to heat it with hydrogen presence of hydrogen right now this two are introduced into an means they are allowed to uh, an electric discharges sent to this then what happens suppose if i take two coke here so this becomes c2 
H2. This is the old method of preparation of C2H2 or acetylene. CH, this is your old method, very simplest method. Now, we have the modern, modern method of preparation of acetylene. What do they do? Just now I said this, uh, the methane. This is here in the industrial method. Here also we have methane. In the modern method, what they are going to do is, they are again going to take methane. Right? So, methane. This is allowed to combust. Okay. Right. But here the temperature which they are going to take is 150 degrees centigrade. When they heat it at 150 cent degrees centigrade, but important thing is, here we are going to take 6 moles of methane. When you take 6 moles of methane, just simple, we very well know whenever methane is combusting, whenever it is heated in the presence of oxygen, what are the byproducts we get? We get carbon dioxide plus wa uh, listen, water. But here, what is happening, when they are controlling the temperature to 150 degrees, you get carbon dioxide plus hydrogen. Apart from that, you also get acetylene. Because CH4, you know, they're dividing the CH4. So, one product you get it as acetylene. Now, let us balance. 6, isn't it? 6 for the 24. So, let us write 2 hydrogen here. 2. Okay, this is not carbon monoxide. It is carbon monoxide, right? It is 2 carbon monoxide and 10 hydrogens. Let me, let me count. 10. So, 10, 2 is 20. 21, 22. Okay. 22, 23, 24. Yeah. Right. And uh, next comes carbon here 2 to the 4 5 6 oxygens 2 oxygens 2 oxygens balanced right so this is these are the products when you take uh, methane and the limited uh, means the temperature is limited to 150 degrees so this is the first method of preparation of alkynes old method that is industrial method then further i have taken you to the further methods then bertillate synthesis where you are taking the old method is this and the modern method of uh, getting the acetylene from methane is they are represented here. So, thank you for watching students. Now, I will show you then in my next video, I will be showing you how is alkyne prepared from means you are preparing the lower alkynes uh, from the higher alkynes or you can also prepare the other way also. You can prepare uh, higher alkynes from lower alkynes both the ways. So, in my next method, I will be teaching you how to prepare or means how are we going to prepare higher alkynes from lower alkynes. Thank you for watching students.